Okay, cool. Um, is it possible to return as a result a list of objects of different types from different tables to mix them? For example, um, if I would have a, a room and a room consists of furniture and uh, I have um, one table with chairs and one table with um, cupboards, is it possible to create a list with uh, where the first uh, element is a, is a chair, the second is a chair, the third is a cupboard, the fourth is whatever. Is it possible? Right. Be because for example, for example in, in, in MongoDB, I can return a, a, a list of objects of different types, but I hadn't figured it out how to return a list of objects of different types in, uh, in Xeno. Yeah, I think I'm following. Let's see if I can do a very quick example for you. Um, okay, let's go ahead and just quickly here, let's just populate some data here. And I think there's already a user. Um, okay. So you're asking how to basically get uh, objects from different tables and combine them in the response. Yeah. Okay. So let's get do a get record from info, and let's just go ahead and do table reference info here. Get that, and then we'll also get a record from user. Oops. Okay, so you'll notice if I return both of them, they'll be separate, but we'll be able to see there's two different objects here. I think it's just user one and one here. So we want to be able to basically combine this into a single object. I'm returning user one variable. There we go. Okay, there we go. So we have two separate objects here. We want them to be one, um, or we want them to be in the same result, right? So what we can do, let's go ahead Wait, and- that, that is what you want, right, Patrick? Yes, or, I want to return a list of this, where the first object is, uh, is the, uh, the result ID and the second is user ID, yeah. This is the object with, with, with two different uh, properties. Right, I, 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 think I, um, I think I understand here, so what we can do is we should be able to make a combined result variable here and we'll make this an array and then i should be able to use push here ah oh, cool to first push info one and then user one should work. And now let's go ahead and get rid of these and return combined result. And we can remove that. So like that, was that what you're looking for? It's perfect. Cool. Very, very good. You're yeah, so, so thank you very much.